Then we go for the kill. Any ideas how I draw him out? We killed his unborn child. Get him rabbit. Got it. But do not try and kill him. He is immortal until I shut down the Hellgate. Right. This is it, Dante. We have to put our lives into each other's hands completely. Uh, excuse me? Hesitation. I'm the one going to piss him off. After all. You just have to close the Hellgate. I have to piss him off. Alright, uh, here we go. The final boss of DMC Double May Cry. You know, I've been asked this question once. Why? Where the fuck am I playing this? I want to give you guys a comparison, to be honest. Show you the things that this game does right, and then show you a good Devil May Cry game. Because in my opinion, one of the few things that this game does wrong is the characters. Why did you kill my child? Because it was fun. I will ask you again. Why did you kill my child? Because you killed Why'd my Why'd you mother. kill my parents? Oh. But you banished one. So it was revenge. I see. Not quite. Than that. Oh? It was for freedom. Freedom? You seem to have all the freedom you need. The freedom to murder my heir. I'm not talking about my freedom. I'm talking about mankind's. I kind of had to fight to do that stuff. And what would mankind do with freedom, do you suppose? I kind of agree with this. Because when I mean, I look arrived, at, they had it. In all honesty, look at what we do to each other. And now add demons to the mix. It. So, yeah, we, we'd be pretty fucked. I mean, he's doing it all wrong. He's doing it power-hungry-wise. But, uh, a little bit later on, there might be a little bit of surprise who I agree with and over what. Besides violence, war, death. I thought you were in the human world. You know, I'm in this. You're right. It wasn't for mankind, it was. It was for revenge. I gotta tell you, killing your child like that, watching it explode into little wet chunks, hearing you scream like one of your little demon bitches. Priceless. <laughs> oh. Ow. Mama. Ow. So you are in Mother. Ah. Ow. Ah. Oh, mother of God, it hurts. I'm going to make you watch while I eat your beating heart. Son of a bitch, that hurts. Okay, let's shut this thing down. I'm sure Virgil will save me any second now. Virgil! Virgil, hurry it up! I can see a light! Huh? Virgil? What have you 
done. Stop the hell, game. Leave Bitch. my brother alone. <laughs> we win. Bitch. Charming. Because I really want to watch a spit glob drop. You okay, Dante? You took your time. You're welcome. <laughs> I never thanked you. The one useful thing he does in the whole game. Yeah, it, it's never that easy, folks. I gotta tell you, I was pretty disappointed by this demon form. Kinda expecting something actually demonic. Instead, we basically just get a Titan. Not a not a an attack on Titan Titan, like a Greek mythology Titan. In fact, that really looks like I forget which one. Which one was the the rock one, the volcano one? Kill him now. I forget what, what his name was. Never. Any ideas? The funny thing is, I killed him in Kingdom Hearts too. His demon child had some. I should know his name. We start there. We'll have to get it open. You're an asshole. No one cares. Keep him busy. I am a man. Oh. Don't attack him. Just stay alive until I expose his eye. Oh, that's all I want. How come we're not getting sucked in? We Did I mention how I love the boss fights in this game? How they almo almost all of them utilize the platforming element? Oh god! Do something! Time to use the conquerors hockey. Now, Dante! Get to the eye! Good say yeah, you are useful. Look, he's showing cracks. Dante, you see that? Yeah, I see it. He's still in there. We need to get in there and kill him. Of course we do, because it just can't be easy. Come on, let's go. Duh, boot. Why was his body in there? Mundus is merged with his physical body. That's why he's protecting it. So if we kill his body, we kill Mundus. It's kind of cool if you could fuck around in the cutscene and change your weapons. Like you can fuck around the no. Assassin's Creed. No. The Assassin's Creed games. Oh, so dies a hero. Oh, so sad. Let's have a moment of silence for Virgil. Okay, moment over. What have you done to him? Whee! 
I remember the first time I did this, I flew right through it like an idiot. Ooh, teleporting. Ow. You suck. Oh yeah. See, that, that teleportation shit can come useful. Ow. Except when you don't use it right, like an idiot. That's one. Thanks, asshole. Come on, Virgil. Oh, is someone mad? Ooh, yes, he certainly is. shit at you in Super Mario World, you'd never be able to kill him. Boom! Haha, <laughs> Angel Flight. Never leave home without it. Suck. Now become the easiest boss fight in the history. Dodge one projectile, teleport over to him. Uppercut. Virgil's contribution. A kick. Whee! <sighs> Yawn. That was fun. Notice how his hair is changing color, by the way. We did it. Yes, we did. You won't be able I to did. see it because of the skin I'm in, <laughs> but uh, later it just it goes completely white during a certain moment. I'll try and point it out. But it's just because I'm using the DMC3 skin. Originally when I played this, I thought this was the end right here. <laughs> 